Job chapter 9 verse 24 the earth is given into the hand of the wicked he covereth the faces of the judges thereof if not where and who is he Job 9.24 again the earth is given into the hand of the wicked he covereth the faces of the judges thereof if not where and who is he giving all praises on and glory to the heavenly father and his only begotten son Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai Bahasham Rukhakodash double honor to my teachers the apostles and the elders of great millstone shall I warm to the Akim worldwide that are sincere and serious to doing the will of Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai Bahasham Rukhakodash 2nd Peter chapter 1 verse 1 and 2 to you all the only brother disciple Koshab and Yamin from the branch of the great millstone Barbados and I have a little article here racist statue of our angel Michael has Gahanian's outrage critics demand parish remove statue of white angel overpowering black devil <coughs> So this, <clears throat> so, like here, so this all goes back to white supremacy, either white supremacy, like to call it, because you you are white. If you're white means pure, holy, and there's nothing pure and holy about you, either mites, nothing. And this is the statue here. This is the statue here you see before you. A white angel, Michael the Archangel, man, no beard on his face. Look like a damn woman overpowering a black devil. Hmm? You see that? And the angels are not so called white either. There's no leprosy in, in the kingdom of heaven. So like yeah, there's no leprosy in heaven where the more sight and the angels dwell. It tells you that the angels are dark skinned man. But as you see here, they have cover the faces of the judges thereof and set up their their self as a um, let me get that scripture and they set up their self as the angels as God huh so really what they did was blasphemy of the Holy Spirit they blasphemed the words of the Lord Yahweh so there's going to be a retribution for all that you either might have done, man. There's going to be a serious retribution for you have done. You see, you did all of this and you didn't consider your latter end. Right? Um so like here is um is second Maccabees one no man. How did the scripture go now? So like here, man. Um, all right, hold a minute. So this is what the heathen did, huh? And the top heathen that did this was Esau Eden. Oh, first Maccabees tree. Okay, good. 48. <clears throat> I laid open the book of the law, which is the Bible, wherein the heathen had sought to paint the likeness of their images. You understand? So this is what it did. They laid open the book of the law, wherein the heathen had sought to paint the likeness of their images. Right? And this is what it did. You see? Right? And I want you to know that this 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 same image is on um, a crest. Is on a crest that um. Let me see if we get here. This same image is on a crest, right? In the um. Let me read it. This is KCMG, the highest order given traditionally to diplomats and oversee personnel by the queen in the new year honors list 
it says zoom into the image and you'll see why and how the UK GB is racist and until this is all rooted out of all traditions etc nothing will change so let me zoom in here look. and what you can see a white a so-called white angel overpowering a black devil you see you see that so they did all of this and um, didn't consider their latter end they thought that the Mosai that's what that I don't know kind of my mind boy that's Psalms 50 I think that's Psalms 50 was true in a minute they thought that the Lord was one with them that's Psalms 50 brother um, let me see if that's Psalms 50 boy it's great telling me Psalms 50 though you know what I mean Psalms 50 Psalms 50 and um Psalms 50 and let me start at 19 man Psalms 50 verse 19 thou givest thy mouth to evil and thy tongue frame of deceit so I uh, hey so and this is part of deceit you see, they tell a lot of lies, man. They distort history, right? And they took the true images of the angels of our Lord Yahweh and His Son Yahweh Shai, right? And set themselves up, right? <laughs> you think that you think that they're not going to be retribution for that, man? You making sport, man? The Lord got a day, an hour, a time. A month, a minute, ready for you devils, man. Alright? Thou give us thy mouth to evil and thy tongue frame of deceit. You always tell a lot of lies on, on us too, right? The accuser of our brethren that we you accuse us every day, man. Right? Thou sittest and speakest against thy brother, thou slanderest thy own mother's son. These things has thou done, and I kept silence. Thou thoughtest that I was altogether such an one as thyself. You thought the Lord was with you, man, when you did atrocities like this, man. You really thought the Lord was with you? Yes, God is with us, man. This is manifest destiny. That what that demon uh, Christopher Columbus said, uh, huh? But I will reprove thee and set them in order before thine eyes. So the Lord's gonna set us in order before your eyes, man. He's doing it already, man. Huh? He's doing it already, man. He's setting us in order, man. You see? So everything you 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 either must have done, man, is coming back to haunt you, man. All the, the, the lies that you 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 uh pushed out in the world. Which scripture says? Um, that's Isaiah 28. That's Isaiah. Isaiah 28. You see, the water is a sweeping away the refuge of lies, man. Isaiah 28 and. Um, 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 Ah, good, 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 good. So let me start at 15. Because ye have said we have made a covenant with death, now there's all wicked people, right? And we fell, or we had agreement, yeah, you agree with Esau, Edom. When this overflowing scourge shall pass through, it shall not come unto us, for we have made lies our refuge. And on the falsehood have we hid ourselves, because our people believe in this too. You understand? They believe in this image you see right before you. God is white. Angels white, the damn beard, all this, all this, that's so, so, so feminine, huh? You want to talk there? Look at the damn woman, the old man. On the on the falsehood have we hid ourselves? Therefore, thus saith the Lord, power behold, I lay in Zion a for a foundation of stone, 
a tried stone, a precious cornerstone, <clears throat> a sure foundation. He that believeth shall not make here. So who's this precious cornerstone? Our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shaya Mashiach, who you ignorantly call Jesus Christ. Another blasphemy because you 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 took down the true name of our Lord and Savior and call him Jesus. When you went into the land, you saw the true name of the Lord, you said it is it is too pure for sin from man to utter. Meaning what? Meaning us. And you removed it and put Lord and you put God and you put the word Jesus there. Huh? Therefore thus save the Lord God behold I lay in Zion for a foundation, a stone, a tree stone, a precious corner, a stone, a sure foundation. He that believeth shall not make his. Judgment also will I lay to the line and righteousness to the plummet and the hill shall sweep away the refuge of lies and the water shall overflow the hiding place so the refuge of lies is being swept away by the waters man and what's the water is the word that is the first thing first and foremost you understand you get one more scripture man right it tell that in second corinthians man you say second corinthians um Ten, it's like the waters pulling out all the lies you eat. The mice have 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 um, put up over the years, man. Through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, man. Yahweh means He is. Bahashim means in the name. Yahweh Shai means He is the deliverer, a redeemer, a who the nation of Israel, which are you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Second Corinthians ten. And three, for though we walk in the flesh, we do not war after the flesh. For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through the more sight to the pulling down of strongholds. And as we've seen here, man, these strongholds that you eat, saw, that you eat the mice have put up is being pulled down, man. By the truth, man. Right? Casting down imaginations and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of the more sight. So that's what we're doing. Casting down all these lies, man. You see? Casting down all these lies. Right? And every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of the Mosai and bring into captivity every thought to the obedience of Hamashiach. <clears throat> so that's what we're doing. Casting out all the lies that you devils have put up. You understand? The angels are dark skinned. The children of Israel are dark skinned, man. You understand? Our Lord and Savior is dark skinned, man. Right? Revelation 1 and 1 the revelation of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach which the Moasai gave unto him to show unto his servants things which must shortly come to pass and he sent and signified it by his angel unto his servant John who bear record of the word of the Moasai and of the testimony of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach and of all things that he saw and the word revelation means to reveal or the appearance of Alright. Verse 13. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot, and girded about the pots with a golden girdle. His head and his ears were white like wool, as white as snow, and his eyes were as a flame of fire, and his feet like unto fine brass, as if they were burned in a furnace, and his voice as the sound of many water so the our lord and savior was a so-called dark skinned man so he mean to tell me he's the only dark skinned angel there and all the rest is so-called white uh, that's leprosy man that the lord don't deal with that man <clears throat> right wait a minute did not the lord turn miriam leprous because she opened she down out huh so did not the lord tell moses put your hand in your bosom are you take it out and give me leprous white as snow? This is blasphemy the Holy Spirit, man. And you, let me get this last scripture, right? And you Edomites will pay for what you have done. You Edomites will pay 
And that can be a beautiful day, yeah, boy. That can be a beautiful, beautiful day, boy. Yeah, boy, she may wish I know, boy. And that can be a beautiful, beautiful day, boy. I would love to see that. I would love to see that, boy. You have a right to say, boy. Meaning you have a villain. You know that you would like to see that, boy. Isaiah 47, I want to come down and sit in the dust, O virgin daughter of Babylon. Sit on the ground where there is no throne, O daughter of the Chaldeans, for thou shalt no more be called tender and delicate. So your throne is over. St. Bartholomew, Lord, is telling you, look, your throne is over and it's time to come in a low state and be the slave that I created you to be. You're no, you're no more going to be a king, man. Your rulership is over. Take the millstones and grind meal and cover thy locks, make bare the leg, and cover the thigh, pass over the river. It's time for you to be a slave now, man. You understand? What you do with the millstone? You grind. You grind uh, whatever, <clears throat> whatever, um, wheat, barley, whatever you put in there to grind. Right? Wherever you put in there, uh, uh, stones to grind, up, to grind them up small. Wherever you put in the millstone to grind, man. Time to work. Thy nakedness shall be uncovered, yet thy shame shall be seen. So now we see your nakedness, man. How lad you are. I will take vengeance and they will not meet thee as a man. So our Lord is coming back in an angelic, powerful being, man. Now let me get to the point. Alright? To lock him on. Um, you didn't consider a lot of aim, man. Right? Isaiah 47 and 7. And thou saidest, I shall be a lady forever, so that thou didst not lay these things to thy heart, neither didst remember the latter end of it. So you didn't think that you won't be recompensed for this? <clears throat> you didn't think so, huh? but our Lord is coming to remove you off your throne, man, and set back up righteousness on this earth. Shalom.